Greetings, I'm Arlisha Corley, and I'm here to do a closing prayer for you that we would usually do at my church, St. Martin's Episcopal Church, as we hold hands and we sing, let the church say amen. One of the ministerial staff does the closing prayer, and I'll do a closing prayer for you today. Dear precious Lord, we come to you today telling you thank you. Prepare us as we walk out of these doors today. Allow the Holy Spirit to shine in our hearts, our minds, our bodies, and our souls. Allow us to relay the message by way of the Spirit. Even though at this particular time, such a time as this, we are not able to go out and touch people physically. The beauty of the Holy Spirit thank you Lord is that you will allow the Spirit of the Lord to touch those hearts and minds that we can't touch physically we ask that you open up the gates of blessings on those that are ill we ask that you open up the gates of love for those that are in need and feel alone in their homes today allow us to be the beacon of light by way of the Holy Spirit for you today even going on to Facebook and presenting a picture with a smile. So as we leave today, Father, we ask that you allow us to have the right mind to be able to convey your word to those that are in need who might call us on the phone this week or might talk to us on some of the other platforms. Allow us to be able to express your word of love, your word of hope, your, your word of faith, allow us to be present for them, even though they cannot necessarily touch us. But you can touch each and every one of us, Father and Mother. In the mighty, mighty name of Jesus Christ, who is our Lord, our Master, and our Savior. Amen.